As everyone waits in anticipation for the American Idol finale, former contestants are already prepping for the big tour. We caught up with Katie Stevens to get the inside scoop and what the future holds. Speaking words of wisdom. Top 10 American Idol contestant Katie Stevens had to wait a long time to get her chance on American Idol. I began watching Idol the first season, so I was eight years old, and I just remember looking at my mom and saying, Mom, I want to audition for that, but then I found out I only had, I had to be 16, so I had to wait eight years. After becoming a contestant, Katie quickly became known as one of the biggest voices on the show, and she says it isn't because of any formal training. I... I have always been singing, so I would sing from the moment that I woke up until I went to bed. So I really didn't have a lot of formal training, but I mean, singing in the shower and stuff helps, so. <laughs> Being a fan herself, the 17-year-old does have her idol favorites. You better take it from me. I love Carrie Underwood, but I think for me, I love Jordan Sparks just because she was so young. And that kind of gave me inspiration that maybe I could have won being 17. When it comes to this year's competitions, we asked if she's still voting. I am, but I'm not going to tell you who my favorites are. <laughs> With Katie's love for music, it's not a big name artist who's had the biggest pull for her. It was family. I like all different types of music, but I would say somebody who's influenced me with music is my brother because he started performing first and he picked up the guitar and the piano first. So every time I would see him do something, it influenced me to want to do it. She does have one specific big name in mind when it comes to the possibility of singing a duet. Everybody thinks I'm weird, but I would love to sing The Prayer with Andrea Bocelli because I think that it's a beautiful song and he's amazing, so I would love to sing with him. Katie doesn't hold too many hard feelings after being voted off, but admits she would have liked to have stayed around for Inspiration Week. For Inspiration Week, I was actually going to sing Somewhere Over the Rainbow, but I actually got that opportunity to sing it on the Ellen DeGeneres show, so I was excited to sing that. After making it to the top ten and now heading for the Idol tour, the teen has advice for even younger fans. I definitely say always keep singing and keep pursuing your dream because I'm proof that any Anything you set your mind to, you can do. Because I wanted to audition for Idol, and I took the chance, and I went and I auditioned, and here I am. And the future is promising for the young singer. Long term, I would like to do pop with leanings to R&B, like Kara had suggested for me. But in the short term, you can still catch her on the American Idol tour this summer. The tour starts July 1st in Auburn Hills, Michigan. So it will go until September 15th. And if you want to see the winner of American Idol, well, you'll just have to tune in to Fox tomorrow night.